Hi guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. I hope you guys are doing amazing. As always, just an FYI, I will be posting about four times this week. It's gonna be a little bad bitch giving because I know you guys are gonna be bored. You know, you guys have break. You're gonna be a little bit bored. And I wanna be a little bit entertaining for you guys. So that's what I'm gonna be doing. But for today's video, as you've seen by the thumbnail, we are gonna be dressing in different decades. So we're gonna be dressing from 1950s to 2010s. So I'm gonna have a paper filled with different decades and we're gonna randomly raffle it and whatever we get we're going to have the dress in that fashion of that decade but right now i'm gonna show you guys the fit and then after i'm gonna pick up the kids from school and then we're gonna head to the thrift store and then we're gonna get the clothes come back here change go get some boba go to the store and then we're gonna go eat at denny's and that's gonna be for today's video so let me show you the fit this is the fit i got this karomi sweater from the last video these gray cargo sweats these black freaking crocs like always and my black first all right let's go get them Picked up Angie. Now we're gonna go pick up Chola Boy and Emo Girl. Let's go. All right, we picked up Cassie and the kids from high school. You know those booger ass kids, those stink ass kids. Anyways, I have the decades written in these papers right here, and we're about to raffle them. Grab your decade. I want 2000s. So I ended up with 1970s. That's a good fashion era. At Lily entered a pick. Okay, okay. Oh, what did you get? The 2000s. Oh, 2000s. That's a good era. Mm. What did you get, Chola Boy? <laughs> The 1980s. <laughs> he got the 1980s, guys. I think that's Greece era. Okay, what did you get, emo girl? 2010. 2010s. Okay. Whenever I think of 2010s, I always think of Snoop Dogg. I don't know why. No, the dark, the the hella dark makeup. Haven't you seen the videos? All right. I'm not doing their makeup. I got the 50s. 1950s. Long skirts. They're freaking. Um, I always think of poodles when I think of 1950s. Me too. But right now, guys, we pulled up to the. You can't even see the thrift center, and we're about to go inside and start thrifting outfits let's go the rift center oh my god they left me hey wait for me all right guys we're gonna be finding the clothes one by one here this shit is a huge ass thrift store so we're gonna help angie look for her outfit first because she's the 1950s and then we're gonna go down all the way to the 2010s what do you have so far angie right here she has these two long skirts because you know the 50s they scream long skirts we're looking for a top if not we're looking through the dresses to see what she likes this guy over here is just fucking doing willies with the damn cart security kick his ass out security security look at this dude oh he finna flip that bitch girl what the fuck so angie found her freaking outfit angie show us what did you get i got this white button up shirt white button up shirt fits the vibe uh, and that skirt. pink skirt put it on your body like yeah look this. that's the that's the vision for guys and then we were looking around the shoes Tell me these shoes right here do not scream like 1950s till 1960s. So she's going to get the shoes as well to pair with the outfit. Okay, so Angie's done. She's done finding all hers. Now it goes from 1950s. I skipped 1960s. So we're going to 1970s, which is my outfit. And I was walking through here. Tell me why I kind of want to do this. Does that go? Yeah, yeah. Bro, I'm kind of contemplating or this. Like, I know they wear a lot of fur, bell bottoms, like low key like this is gonna one. be one option i was looking through the sweater section and i also seen this one it kind of screams 1970s so i'm putting the oh, 34.90 let's put that back i don't want to spend a whole fucking bag on a used sweater so i was contemplating over this yellow one or this white one so i'm gonna try them both on and see which fits better i was gonna take this sweater but the sleeves are too short but i like how long it is I feel like a princess and she was a fairy this is how this one looks i think i'm gonna take this one it fits better and it's comfy emo girl wants the black christmas tree she said it's for emo christmas girl no you gonna buy that shit not me so for the 70s i got this fluffy jacket and these like striped pants that are like really loose at the bottom i fuck with these i fuck with these and then a turtleneck because i always think of turtlenecks too so I think that's my whole outfit, guys. Now, moving on from the 1970s to the 1980s. He got a white t-shirt, show the pants. And then he got these black pants. He was going more for like a greaser look. We need to slick back his hair. I feel like that would do, that would be the complete look. That would be the complete look. And now that we finished with 1980s, we are moving to the 2000s. Cassie's outfit, what did you find? Bell bottom pants. Some bell bottom pants, of course. Okay, that does scream 2000s. The little hat and scarf. Ew. Okay, one of those hats. I really like this hat, guys. Look how sparkly it is. It does give 2000s. 
lessons. So this is like her outfit so far. This is Chola Boy sliding into the girls' DMs. Like, what you doing, mamas? Ugh, where are you going with that raggedy ass? You're gonna fucking bump into my Theo, bro. 2010 outfit. Show the outfits. Okay, she. Okay, she got the little beanie, the little blue belt, this little ass tiny ass shirt. I could see this one for 2010s, and then these booty ass little shorts. Okay, I kind of see the vision here. What the hell are they drilling shit over there, compa? You're not supposed to turn it off. We purchasing everything now. We just got off the thrift store, guys, and look at how dark it is. The girls are back there. And now that we're done shopping, we're gonna go to the house and change, and then the activities are gonna start. So let's go. Angie, before 1950s Angie, show the shoes. The shoes are the complete outfit. Okay, okay. Lily, before 1970s Lily. Cholo Boy, before. 1980s Chola boy. He kind of looks the same. He's a greaser. He got the toothpick in his face, ready to fight everybody. Cassie before? 2000s Cassie. She looks like she has a blueberry phone in her pocket. Emo girl before? 2010 Emo girl. Rar XD. Dun, 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 dun. It's giving Snooky from Jersey Shore. We left the house, guys, and we came to get some boba. Look at us in our funky outfits, though. I'm not, I don't know Ooh. about you, but my, my uh, not You look bright as fuck. Either, no, Let's go in. Either. I didn't record inside, guys, because there was people, and they were probably going to be like, why is this bitch recording? But I got a mango drink. And what'd you get? Uh, Haki, I, I don't know what it's called. Haki, I don't drink milk drink. What did you get, Chola Boy? Milk. Same one as me. And Berna got a what? Milk drink. A milk drink? It's like a coffee drink. What did you get, Angie? I got an Oreo one. Yeah. Just alarming you guys, Angie is lactose, so it's about to be stinky in here. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> but now that we got her bubble, we're going to go to the store and see if we can find some snacks. Walking into the store, guys, and tell me why we're all walking That's in like good. goofy ass. <gasps> I almost tripped on that bullshit. Anyways. So look at us, how goofy we're gonna go in like this, guys. Actually, the style has changed nowadays, so maybe they won't mind. We're getting a little bit of stairs, but maybe it's because this fucking shirt's not ironed. All right, we're in the chip aisle now, guys. There was some kid from my school. The guy from your school totally looked at your outfit. Oh, she's dipping. She's dipping. Runaway bride. What did you get? Trident gum? Yeah, because your breath be stanking and banging. Oh, wait. Chill, 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 bro. So since we're in the chip aisle, guys, that means we're not getting any chips that support Israel because we do not support genocide. So no Lay's, no Doritos, no Cheetos, no basically all the fucking chips on this freaking aisle, bruh. I used to play this when I was little. Do you want that or what? You want that? All right, you can get that. You can get that, honey. I used to play with Sophie when I lived Girl, you used to play yesterday. Calm down. Oh. What? We left the store now, guys, and we just got Takis because, you know, they're not part of genocide. And now we are going to go to Denny's. So we arrived to Denny's. Let's go win, everybody. <gasps> oh, we should low-key. <gasps> Why do I want one of those? And then, look, you could win a ball. What happened, Angie? <gasps> Squishies. But what are the chances of you winning those? Zero. Who knows? My goofy little family. We got our own little booth, guys. Pass out the menus because I know y'all's is hungry. So we're all just waiting for our food right now and the kids are playing games on their phones. What are you playing? He's playing Clash Royale, no sponsorship. What are you playing, Angie? Roblox. Gen Z shit. And the girls are over here. They're they're contemplating whose butt smells worse. Emo girls <laughs> are cats. And guess who won? Who won? Who won? Yes. Both I of don't them. Even know. Both of them won. We'll get back to you guys when we get our food. Cause I'm starving. Our food came, guys. I got an avocado burger with the side of jalapenos as always, and some fries and a water. What did you get, Chola boy? Some burnt wings. Some burnt wings, guys. Look at it. She's burnt as fuck. They overcooked that bitch. Them fucking chicken wings was there for like all motherfucking day and they just reheated them. What about you, Angie? Angie's the basic friend of the group. Chicken tenders and fries. That she's freaking, freaking, that she freaking chugged. All right, what about you, Cassie? I got the bacon and the Copycatter. Onion hanging out. Onion hanging out. And then emo girl is in the shitter. She's taking a big dookie. She got this. She got this macaroni and cheese with, bro, her shit's burnt. Guys, zoom into that burnt piece. She's gonna choke when she gets out the bathroom. <laughs> oh. Cheers, mukbang. Mm -hmm. 
out of jalapeno. Mm. This food makes me feel like. <gasps> Emo girl takes the skillet home <laughs> to cook with it. She's taking her food home, guys. Everybody's taking their leftovers. And she barely touched her damn plate. Trolla boy doesn't eat his little turds, but he is taking them home. <laughs> We're gonna dance in our decade. Go. Yeah, how do they do it? Do you want it like this? It's like wait. We decided we're going to play this damn machine. Cholo boy, we have all the faith in you. <gasps> come on, come on. <gasps> Bro. Now Angie's gonna try to get a plushie. What the fuck? Oh! No way, no way. The chances of you winning that is crazy. All right, guys, so I'm gonna end the video off right here because it's already like 9 p.m. and I'm gonna drop off all the kids at their homes. But I wanna thank you guys so much for watching and I hope you guys are enjoying the vlogs. And I made up my mind, I am going to be doing Vlogmas this year, so look out for Vlogmas in December. But I love you guys and I'll see you in the next vlog. Bye, guys.